Good Monday afternoon, everybody. Meteorologist Robert Serbeck with you here for another check of that Labor Day afternoon forecast. Great day to fire up the grill or the smoker and cook dinner outside. We'll see temperatures in the uh, upper 70s and lower 80s. A sunny and less humid day, however, will be a little bit on the breezy side. Let's take a quick look back at August. Our warmest day in Lexington was 98. Our coolest morning was 51. Uh, a pretty average month for precipitation, just slightly below average. 3.46 inches, about a quarter of an inch below where we should be with well over an inch of rain falling on August 17th. Now, as we leave August and head into September, really a month of extremes. Uh, you know, you see there it was 103 one day in 1954, but the coolest temperature was the freezing mark set back in 1899. We've also had a whole lot of rain and very little rain. In fact, very little rain just a few years ago. Look at that, just a one year difference here. Uh, what a difference. Now, if I had to guess, I would say that this was tropical related in nature, uh, that, that 10 inches here. But on average, we should get about three and a half inches. We'll see what this September has in store for us. No rain today, just comfortable temperatures, upper 70s and lower 80s with that stiff northeasterly breeze continuing to funnel in that cooler and drier air. But those winds will remain pretty constant even as we get into tonight. You see those wind streams still moving at a pretty good clip. Could by tomorrow morning could see a little bit of high level cloudiness start to filter in. Really no big deal, but just one thing to kind of filter out the sun. Probably looking at mostly cloudy skies uh, for our Tuesday. Mostly cloudy, considerable cloudiness, whichever uh, verbiage you want to use. But notice by the lunch hour, temperature still lower 70s. I think most of us will certainly take that. So a uh, very nice day today across the entire bluegrass into the mountains. Great for any outdoor activities that you might have. And again, a little crisp tonight, 50s with that persistent northerly wind. Crack those windows open. Give the AC a rest. I don't see any upper 40s tonight, but that will be changing as we look at the extended forecast. Yeah, this week, really nice and quiet. By Friday, a, a stronger cold front will start to make its presence felt with some showers. Behind that front, oh boy, temperatures really cool off. Big time taste of fall here. Into the 70s for highs. Morning lows, both Saturday and Sunday morning, most likely in the upper 40s.